Hi, this is James with the WP Ninjas, and I want to talk about creating layouts with the Layout and Styles extension for Ninja Forms. When you install a Layouts and Styles extension uh, and you edit one of your forms, you'll have a new tab called Layout and Styles. Clicking on that will give you this screen here. Uh, and it's really simple to use. We're just going to go over some of it real quick. One of the first things you'll see is these columns. You have uh, you can choose up to one to two to three to four columns. Now, right now, you don't necessarily want your form to look like this um, for just automatically. You need to have some ability to resize and make these fields take up different sections. So, what we're going to do is we're going to create a simple form. Uh, by default, you'd have one column. And we're going to create a simple form where first name and last name are side by side, and email and mobile are side by side. Perhaps home address takes up a full line. City, state, and zip do three columns, uh, and so forth. So we're going to create a simple layout like that. It's real easy. All we do is click, I'm going to choose four columns because of our need to have actually three columns at one point. And we're going to just resize these. Now, the way you resize your field elements is just clicking this resize button. It's basically a toggle, just make it one step bigger each time you click it. Click it when it's at its full size and it'll go right back down to the first available size. So we want two columns and we have four columns total so we're going to go ahead and do that and that'll get it taking up 50 percent of the space of our four columns and last name will do the same thus creating a two column for first name and last name. We'll do the same thing for email and mobile. Home address we want to take up the full line. We may have a long address to home address line. City will let it take up two, a little bit longer, but state and zip only need one. We want the message to take up one, uh, a full line, full column, if you will. And perhaps we'll do the same thing with our anti spam message. And there we go. And that's all we had to do. Now we have this great column layout. We have two columns, two columns. This takes up one full column, three for our address, city, state, and zip line. And our message, our anti spam, and our uh, and our send button and that's really all it takes to create a really simple layout but the power goes much beyond that because you can also do some styling you'll notice these styling buttons or modify form styles these buttons are based on just this form or just these fields so when you export this form you'll get only the styles that are attached to this form and when you create new forms and modify styles for those forms it won't affect this particular form it'll just affect those forms so here you can see you can modify your container for this particular form in rows and success and error messages and for each of these fields even if you've created default stylings for some of you know your say your text boxes you can override them right here and do more specific styling just for these individual elements if you wanted to. What's really nice about that is that if you create a really great form that you're going to reuse a lot and you like the style and layout of it, you can do it all right here and when you export it all of the styling will go with it and you will be able to import it on any other site and you'll have this exact same layout and the exact same styling for this particular form and all of these same fields very powerful then you can just tweak so that's uh, how easy it is to do layout and styling with the layout and styles extension for ninja forms i hope you watch some of our other videos and purchase the extension it's extremely powerful i use it all the time now thanks for watching and i will see you soon